are so many things that I want to do, but I just run out of drive. There are so many things to share with you, yet I wonder why I'm alive. My world's mine, and yours is yours, and I really don't want to change it. But I think that love is the primary cause why I'd like to rearrange it. There's so much love I could give to you. I just want that you should know it. There are so many reasons to live for you. I just wish that I could show it. My world's mine, and yours is yours. And I know that yours is free. But I don't want to live in this world of mine. If I must live here, as me. for long periods under a tree watching the leaves fall. If I were a good poet I would have said long lonely periods but really they weren't lonely at all because you were always there with me. And as each leaf would float to the ground like a waterlogged stick in a still pond I'd think about love. Our love was once like a healthy tree that stretched its arms out like a new baby who does it and doesn't know why. I always thought of that as a kind of sapling love, like a little tree who's proud and wants to push its way through to the sky. And that's just how it was with us. But as our little tree got older, the branches got brittle and we had all sorts of intruders, sometimes a butcher bird, sometimes a dove, and then slowly, because probably our tree cared more about growing than knowing. We found the intruders were more than we could take. And right in the sunshine of our lives, when we should have been strong and proud, the tree became unsure of itself, and occasionally it would shake. And when it did, each leaf that fell became a dream or a hope. And finally one day I saw my own heart falling from above. But have you ever watched a leaf fall, fragile and small, from a tall tree? Every now and then a breath of air catches it and up it goes again. Well, that's how it is with me. Now my life is like a tired tree, living on the moisture of a covered up tear, hoping that every now and again a little breeze of love would lift my heart to where it was when you were near. But no love is that strong. Just the same. No man's heart deserves a living death. So please, try and love me. But take a deep breath. plan. I want you to love, not only as a man, but as a sensitive human being, alive, seeing things, and wondering how many people go through life blundering over material things that anyone can buy. Try and find a man who can be content looking at cold water shining over a colored stone, 
and you'll find a man who's never alone. Try to be that man. Be a supporter of nature's appreciation plan. Look, feel, and love. Look at clouds, feel the wind, and love, love. But always keep the wonder of a little boy, even when you're fully grown, and you keep all those special feelings that not many men have known.